Well, new this morning, an Indianapolis woman is celebrating a big milestone today. Dorothy Stewart turns 100, Carlos. That's amazing. Meredith spent time with her and her daughter to hear all about her life, which is amazing, over the past century. If you could describe your mom in one word, what would that word be? Supportive. Meet Dorothy Stewart born in 1920. It's amazing to me that she was born almost in one pandemic and now she's living through another. In 1920, the Spanish flu pandemic was coming to an end as Dorothy's life was really just beginning. She fell in love with our dad. Yeah. He went to the army. Um, they stayed in complete contact. She even took a train out to California to see him. Moments from the last 100 years captured as memories in photo albums. Mom has been this solid rock, very quiet, very uh, thoughtful. She's always been very active. Like if Robin and I were taking an aerobics class at Warren, Mom came too. <laughs> now Dorothy was really excited we were there, but she did have a little trouble hearing us as we stood far apart with our masks on to keep everyone safe. Something that a lot of families with loved ones in assisted living can probably relate to. Back in March, they resorted to talking to her through the glass doors. I cried. The oh, first I, day, I, I just cried because I wasn't prepared. But through it all, thankfully, Dorothy has stayed really healthy. Luckily, she's been okay. Quietly persisting as she has her entire life. What's the secret to living a long life? All right, so this is amazing. Today, you can actually help Dorothy celebrate her 100th birthday. So here, here, the, hear this. The Arlington <laughs> Place Health Campus is encouraging everyone to dress up, decorate their cars, and drive by the front of the entrance today at 11 o'clock. Okay, so that's at Arlington Place. Dorothy's going to be there, and you can wave at her in your car as you go by. Please stay in your car, but that's a great way to say, hey, happy 100th birthday.